Hi, this video is about the Caribou Mathematics Contest. I'm going to show the solution for the April 2014 Grade 7-8 Contest Question 15, which also came up in the Grade 9-10 and 11-12 contests. So the question is, <coughs> the numbers from 0 to 9 are placed in a bag. Two numbers are selected randomly from the bag and taken out at the same time without replacement. What is the probability that the sum of the squares of the two numbers drawn is more than 100? So to calculate the probability, we would take the number of the events that we want to count and divide that by the number of all possible events. So in our case, for the numerator, which is the number of the events that we want to count, that would be picking two numbers where the sum of their squares is more than 100. And for being just an event, a po any possible event, that would just be picking two different numbers from 0 to 9 at the same time. Okay, so since we're dealing with squares, we want to find out the square of each number from 0 to 9. So 0 times 0 is 0. 1 times 1 is 1. 2 times 2 is 4. 3 times 3 is 9. 4 times 4 is 16, 5 times 5 is 25, 6 times 6 is 36, 7 times 7 is 49, and 8 times 8 is 64, and 9 times 9 is 81. So since all the squares on the left side are a lot less than 100, we will start by picking two of the biggest numbers, so that would be 9 and 8. Okay, so 81 plus 64 is a lot bigger than, a lot more than 100, so therefore that is an event that we want to count. Okay, so now we will take 9 and the next biggest number after 8, which is 7. 81 plus 49 is again a lot more than 100, so therefore that is another event we want to count. Okay, so now we will take 9 and the next biggest number after 7, which is 6. 81 plus 36 is again more than 100, so that is another event that we want to count. Now we will take 9 and the next biggest number after 6, which is 5. 81 plus 25 is again more than 100, so that is another event that we want to count. Now we will take 9 and the next biggest number after 5, which is 4. So 81 plus 16, that is only 97, and that is not more than 100, so that is not an event that we want to count. Okay, so now we will take the next biggest number, which is 8, and we will take the next biggest number after that, which is 7. So we have 64 plus 49 is more than 100, so that is an event that we want to count. Okay. So, now we'll take 8 and 6, because 6 is the next biggest number after 7. So, 64 plus 36 is exactly 100, so therefore it is not more than 100, so that is not an event that we will count. So, now we know that no other numbers on the left of 6 will pair with 8, so that the sum of their squares would be over 100. So now we'll take the next biggest number after 8, which is 7. And since 8 and 6 did not work as a pair for their sums, the sum of their squares to be more than 100, neither will 7 and 6. So therefore, we know that these must be our options. These are the events that we want to count. So we had 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So therefore, we have already 5 in numerator. So now what we want to find out is the denominator. So that is the number of all possible events. All right, so now if we look up here, we can see that for one of the numbers, one out of the two numbers, there are 10 options from zero to nine. And for the other number, since they must be two different numbers because you're picking them at the same time, it must be 10 minus one, which is nine for the other number. So there are nine options for the other number. So we have 10 times 9, which is 90. But again, we must remember that we are picking two different numbers at the same time, and therefore the order does not matter. So for example, it doesn't matter if we pick 0 and 1, 
or then first one and then zero because that would all just count as one event, which is why we must divide 90 by two. So we have 90 divided by two, which is 45. So now we know that we can simplify five over 45. So we will divide both the numerator and the denominator by five. So five divided by five is one. And 45 divided by five is nine. So the answer is 1 over 9. If you'd like to know more about this contest, please feel free to visit our website at www.brocky.ca slash caribou.